Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. The Western Armenian delegation visited the Yerabulur military pantheon. Residents of Artsakh Kolatak village firmly live in their native lands. Construction work of Martaket School No. 1 still continues. The program assistance to the village continues in Javakh. Moscow is ready to discuss the neutral status of Ukraine with Kiev. The world's first cave church is located in the territory of Cilicia in Western Armenia. Armenia. Culture in Western Armenia Vishapakar. The delegation of Western Armenia headed by President Armenak Abramian visited a Yerabulur Pantheon to honor the memory of Commander Andrani Kozanyan on the occasion of the 157th anniversary of the glorious Armenian general. The guest also included compatriots who emigrated from Shushi. During the visit to Yerabulur in memory of the anniversary of the commander, a wreath was laid at his grave. Then a tribute was paid to the memory of fallen soldiers of Asala. President Armenak Abramian delivered a speech in memory of the commander in in which in particular he noted the importance of Andranik's role in Armenian national liberation struggle, as well as the indelible patriotic trace he left in a soul fighting for the Armenians, which guided them in all subsequent battles. Residents of Kolata community of Martaget region of Artsakh firmly live and create on their native land. This was announced by the head of Kolata community, Seydan Avanesian. According to him, the main occupation of the villagers is agriculture and cattle breeding. The village has 345 inhabitants. After the war, 12 houses were repaired from the free housing stone God provided to our deported compatriots. 69 students study and are brought up in a patriotic spirit at the school. There is a municipality and a medical center, a hall of celebration here. The headman presented, noting as a problem the disappointing state of intracommunal roads. According to him, the village is provided with electricity, water supply, but not gasified. In the city of Martaget, construction work is actively underway on the reconstruction of secondary school number no. 1, named after Vladimir Balayan. This was stated by the press secretary of Ministry of Urban Development of the Republic of Artsakh, Marta Danielian. The reconstruction of the right wing of the building, the installation of windows and the strengthening of walls have been completed. At this stage, the roof of the building is changing, Marta Danielian said. According to her, the construction work are carried out in expense of the state budget and a comfort element company. The process is controlled by the Ministry of Urban Development of the Republic of Artsakh. Akhalkalak municipality has been allocated 922,000 lari. Starting in March, the election of priority works will begin in the villages. The mayor's office of Akhalkalak municipality has already created a commission consisting of employees of the mayor's office and Sakre Bulo. As part of this program, many different projects will be implemented in the villages. Last year, the priority works were the construction of mini stadiums and playgrounds, the organization of lightning, the reconstruction of pools for the livestock, and the paving of rural roads. Moscow is ready to negotiate with the leadership of Ukraine on the neutral status of the country and the refusal of deployed weapons on its territory, Vladimir Putin's press secretary Dmitry Peskov told reporters. The president had formulated this vision on what we accept from Ukraine so that a conceptual red van problems can be solved. This is a neutral status and this is a refusal to place weapons. There is another question, is the leadership of Ukraine ready for this? He concluded. The Church of St. Peter Church in Cilician city of Hatay in Western Armenia, known as the first cave church in the world, after being included in a temporary UNESCO World Heritage List, it was restored and landscaped. The church with an area of about 10,000 square meters retained its popularity of being an attractive tourist destination thanks to hiking trails, recreation areas, cafes and extraction offices. After our era, in the 13th, believers of Jesus sacredly gathered here. Then the Church of St. Peter was built in a cave dug in the rocks, which after the Vatican in 1963 proclaimed a piece of pilgrimage for Christians. The Church hosts everyone who wants to make a pilgrimage every year on July 29. Dear compatriots, you can also visit this holy place, which is located in one of the fabulous places of Western Armenia and Cilicia. Many ancient stone monuments dedicated to the cult of Vishapakars have been discovered in Armenian highlands. They are also known as Vishap Dragon, which were built on one act stone and are usually placed near the sources of springs, canals, and reservoirs. It is assumed that these predicators are idols of God protesizing agriculture and irrigation, personifying the cult of water. The dragon was adored in advance as water rain and spirit graving wells. 
Now the musical part, Armenian folk song, Hazar Parov. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.